Hi, in this video, I want to share seven super easy ways to make an extra income with ChatGPT that you can start today. So all you need is a ChatGPT account and a Fiverr account, both of which are free and then you're off to the races. You can also use other freelancing tools uh, and sites such as Upwork, Freelancer, Total, etc. By the end of this video, you will have created a Fiverr gig and know how to fulfill orders coming from Fiverr using ChatGPT. I will take you through the complete process step by step so you can start getting orders and earning money immediately. So make sure to watch this video until the end. Also, please subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss out when we post out a new video with an actionable tip or a tactic that could help your business grow. Okay, let's dive in. The first business service you can offer on Fiverr is writing articles or blog posts. There is a high demand for high quality content for SEO purposes. On Fiverr, you can charge $100 or more for a 500 word blog post. The rate can even increase to $250 or more for longer pieces, such as 1000 or 1500 words. Here's another example. As you can see, blog post writing pays well. Now, you may be thinking, how can you differentiate yourself from others who are also using ChatGPT? After all, it's a free tool that anyone can use to generate articles and blog posts. Well, the key is to do thorough research on your topic to identify relevant questions and use keyword research, uh, sorry, and use keyword research to understand what people are searching for. It's similar to an open book test. Everyone has access to all the answers, but you need to know what to look for and where to look for in order to excel. First and foremost, let us create a ChatGPT account. So let's go to Google and enter ChatGPT. ChatGPT is a part of OpenAI. So click on the link and then once you're there, click on the Try ChatGPT button. At the welcome screen, you need to create an account or login. I already have a ChatGPT account, so I will log in, but creating an account is very straightforward. They need your email and a valid phone number to send the OTP and you're good to go. Once you log in, you will come to the dashboard which has a very clean user interface. You can toggle the light and the dark modes as per your preference. I prefer dark mode because it's easy on the eyes. You can see the capabilities and the limitations section, which will give you a better handle on what to expect. Also, whatever you generate, make sure that you proofread it. To start, the first step is to choose a topic. In my case, I operate a photography website called ShutterTurf and want to write a blog post about graduation photography. So I prompted ChatGPT to create an outline for a blog post, which was quite thorough, but some parts were missing. This is where research comes in to find out more topics. I added two additional subtopics to complete the outline. Okay, once you have a clear outline for your blog post, you can use ChatGPT to generate uh, responses to specific questions one by one. This allows you to add your personal touch during the collating and proofreading process and also makes uh, your content unique to your style, which makes it different from others who are also using ChatGPT for similar type of articles. Now, let's generate text for the intro, subtopics and questions one by one. Once you've done that, the article is ready. You can copy and paste it into Google a document, do some editing and voila, you have a great article ready. If you wanna see the article that I created using ChatGPT, please refer to the description. I will add all the links there. Now that I've shown you how to create an article from scratch using ChatGPT, the next step is to set up a Fiverr gig to start getting orders and earning money. Let's proceed with setting up a Fiverr account. To get started, go to fiverr.com and create an account. I already have an account, so I'm going to log in, but creating an account is very straightforward. Once you log in, you will see the buyer's dashboard. To create a gig, you need to be in the seller's dashboard, so click on Switch to selling and you should see something like this. Click on my business, gigs, and create a new gig. Now, for the title, I will input, I will write a well-researched blog post on photography. For category, I will select articles and blog post. For gig metadata, please select language, topic, tone, and article type. You can choose whatever fits best for you. And then, Select some keywords about your topic selection. In my case, it would be photography, photo shoot, etc. Next, we need to create the packages. Fill in the package name, description, number of words, revision, and other information. Also, Fireworks on reviews, and the more positive reviews you have, the more likely 
you are to get more orders. So my suggestion would be to keep your prices competitive at the start. This way you can get some more orders and have an opportunity to build your reputation and review count. Once you have between 40 to 50 positive reviews, you can then consider revising your prices. Okay, the next step is to add a detailed and compelling gig description. In this section, you should inform your potential buyers about your gig and what they can expect from you. Highlight your qualifications and experiences in the field and let them know why they should choose your services over others. Your gig description should give your visitors the confidence that you are the right person for the job. Also, if there are any FAQs, be sure to add them here. Next, we have the requirements section. This is where you specify what you need from the buyer in order to begin working on the project. For example, in this case, it would be the blog topic and the desired target keyword. It's important to be clear and specific about what you need. And if there are any details that are necessary to complete the project, make sure to mark them as required. Finally, in the gallery section, add an eye-catching thumbnail for your gig. You can use tools like Canva to create one quickly and easily. I'll leave a link for Canva and similar tools in the description for you to check out. Also, you can upload writing samples in the PDF section so that buyers can get a sense of your writing style. To showcase your best work, I recommend creating one to two articles following the ChatGPT workflow as outlined above and then adding them to this section. Now, click on Save and Preview to see how your gig will appear to the buyer and make any modifications necessary. Also, don't forget to take Fiverr's basic grammar test. This is a recent feature on Fiverr to ensure high quality content delivery. Once you've done, hit publish and just like that, you've created your Fiverr gig and are ready to start receiving orders. On a side note, I hope you're getting some value out of this video and if you are, please click that like button and subscribe to our channel. Also in the comments below, let me know how you plan to use ChatGPT to earn some extra income. We all can learn from each other, so your input is very valuable. Okay, back to the video. Another business service you can offer on Fiverr is coming up with creative and catchy brand names or product names. In addition to coming up with the name, you can also offer to generate catchy taglines that complement the name. As you can see on Fiverr, people are willing to pay upwards of $100 for a well-crafted brand name. And you can charge more if you include a tagline as well. Here's another example of a service provider charging $250 for finding a good name. And since he has already 256 reviews, this clearly shows that there is a high demand for this type of service. Okay, setting up your Fiverr gig for naming services is similar to what I've shown you before. Now that you've set up your gig, it's time to move on to the execution phase and use ChatGPT to generate business names and taglines. Let me walk you through an example. Suppose a client wants to start a food photography business and wants you to come up with some potential business names and a tagline. Here's what you need to do. Go to ChatGPT and input the following prompt. I want to start a food photography business can you give me some business name ideas that are one to two words, are easy to spell and should be related to food? And the AI gets to work and generate some great names. When it comes to selecting a business name, there are several best practices to consider. I recommend that you watch my video on this topic to learn more about these best practices and then use that knowledge to shortlist the business names for your client and explain to them why you choose those names. You can find the link uh, to the video right above. I also will leave a link in the description. Also, it's important to check the availability of the corresponding domain name on sites like GoDaddy and the availability of social media handles on namechecker.com. To check the availability of multiple names in bulk, you can follow these steps. Go to Google and search for GoDaddy bulk domain name search. Click on the link that appears in the search results. You'll be directed to a page where you can perform a bulk search. Copy all the names generated by ChatGPT and paste them into the bulk search window. This will allow you to quickly determine which domain names are available. I'll leave the direct link to this tool also in the description. Now, let's move on to generating some slogans. To do this, you can input a prompt into ChatGPT and the AI starts creating the slogans. You can also ask the AI to create slogans that are only three to four words long if you want to keep them short and sweet. And that's it, you will have some great slogans for your client. It's impressive the variety of tasks you can accomplish using ChatGPT in combination with Fiverr. Fiverr can bring in the orders and ChatGPT can help you fulfill them efficiently. There are some more business service ideas uh, on Fiverr that you can use ChatGPT to complete. And these gigs pay very well too. Sales copywriting, email copywriting,
drip email sequences or email automation. Writing newsletters. Ad copywriting. Creating a business or marketing plan. By using ChatGPT, you can save time and quickly create high quality content for these services, allowing you to take more and more orders and increasing your earning potential. If you want me to create a step-by-step -step video on how to use ChatGPT for creating sales copy, email copy, drip email sequence, or any other topic that I've mentioned, please let me know in the comments below. If there is enough interest in the topic, I will create a video for it. So, these were some quick ways to generate some extra income using ChatGPT. In future videos, we'll delve deeper into how to use ChatGPT and other AI tools such as Stable Diffusion, DALI, uh, etc. to create graphic designs, uh, landing pages, YouTube thumbnails, and even start your own SEO agency or SaaS business. In the meantime, check out these two videos from our channel that could help your business grow. I can't wait to see you in future videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.